All right, so this is coming down. All the vines is getting removed. This tree's getting removed. This beautiful one is getting topped chest tight. And we're gonna drop that entire bush to right below the windowsill, which I believe is at about 10 feet or so. So this whole bush is gonna go right in the bin. That power line is hot, but we should be able to avoid it. All of these palms are getting removed. So all the palms are gone. The only thing we're gonna keep is this. Can't remember the name off the top of my head, but all of this is gone. Star of India. We're gonna keep the gardenias and probably top this one too, actually. So take them out. Tea leaves, detailed vines, the tall ones we're gonna cut down because we can't pull them, so we're gonna get it chopped. Rubbish trees gone. There's an hapu'u in here. We'll cut the leaves off the window and leave that one. Everything else gone. These palms are gonna get detailed as best as we can reach. This will be at the end. And the vines all on the side of the house covering this tea leaf bush. This needs to be addressed. All these vines come off. They're probably growing through the screen. So we got to try not to damage the screen. Same thing with the plumbing and the piping. I can get up there and pull them down. And then we got this king grass farm. So there's a septic underneath in the middle. I think it's exposed to cap anyway. Um, these coconut trees, I'm keeping the far one and the one closest to me. All the rest are getting cut out and moved. Um, so these sticks and piles got to get hauled. We're cutting the entire grass and by the looks of it, we're going to have to rake it as well. It's pretty thick. So all this king grass removed. This hibiscus tree cut down to about eight feet. You can see it's taller than the palm. So that's gonna be fluffy stuff. And then this is the final area. We're gonna cut this, make the line shaped. And then everything gets removed except the coconut and the bananas. There's some bunches on them. Just need, need some clearing up. And then the tulips gotta go.